Uh, hello everyone I uh, welcome us to easy English class but before we go to uh, deeply into today's topic I really want to ask us these very simple questions okay do you want to improve your English language uh, fluency do you want to be an effective communicator if the answers to these questions are, are yes uh, please this video and others that I have shot okay they are meant okay for people like you I have um, in some of my videos what I have done is that I've based on research and based on personal experience I've revealed some some hacks okay some tricks uh, some tactics okay that individual learners can really imbibe they can integrate that will make them become effective communicators okay in English English language today is the universal uh, language okay of communication and it is important that we improve or we get good at English uh, language then looking at me it is obvious that I am not a native English language speaker but today I have written okay books okay this 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 happened to be one of my I think my second book that was published in the United States I read articles I trained people on educational neuroscience etc so I have no doubt that if you if I can do it then my listeners or my audience members should be able to, to do even uh, uh, better so today's topic is simply okay basic English grammar okay English a past continuous and a past a perfect okay a past perfect okay, easy English the first thing is okay what is a tense okay a tense is just simply those words in sentences okay that reveal space time that reveal a time okay when certain actions when they actually took place when they are going to take place whether they have taken place whether it, where the action is going to take place in the future if they see so those units okay those units those those bits and pieces of okay particles in a sentence that reveal time that reveal action that tell okay that tell us about verbs are simply known as tenses so today we are going to be looking at the past uh, progressive tense and the past uh, perfect progressive uh, tense let's begin with the past uh, progressive okay one vital information that is important here is that you need to really understand uh, that the, the the subject okay will determine the kind of a verb the the past tense okay verb that you are going to be using if the subject is just one then was is used and if the subject is more than one then we okay plus ing is used when it comes to the past uh, continuous uh, things and then on the other hand when it comes to uh, the uh, the past uh, progr the past uh, perfect progressive uh, tense or the the, the, the the tense for example one, one thing that you need to really put into consideration is uh, that the, the past tense okay the auxiliary verb okay had been okay will be used when it comes to what the past uh, perfect progressive uh, tense and then with in addition to what to i n g but please uh, this explaining it verbally might seem uh, more confusing and that is why i the, 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 I, I titled this video easy english and that is why i have very very simple explanations of each okay of these tenses so please come along while i take you to the whiteboard for very simple and explicit explanation of the past uh, the past continuous tense and the past perfect tense so like i said the subject will determine okay uh, the the verb uh, then plus ing look at the first one is i was talking to her okay was talking is the past uh, continuous verb or tense then you were eating when i came in you were eating when i came in ma okay you were sleeping when i came in then the other one it was sleeping on the mat it it could be an animal it could be a dog your pet okay it was sleeping when okay on the mat it was then this one is a plural pronoun they were okay they were dancing when we arrived that we, we we met the students dancing when we arrived then the next one is they were dancing okay now 
Okay, we were discussing among ourselves. Okay, we sat down and we were discussing amongst ourselves. Since there was nothing to do with completed, okay, our responsibility at that moment, we had to sit down and we were discussing. Then I was running, so I held an what an umbrella. I was running. What is the past a continuous tense? So now let's look at the past progressive. The past progressive. Okay, the, the, uh, do not forget the subject determines. Okay, the the tense then plus ing then look at the sentence the simple use of this i had been sleeping since i came back home i had been sleeping since i came back home i really had a very a very uh, terrible day at work so when i came back up i just went into my bed and i slept off then it had been raining since midnight so i couldn't go uh, to the office it had been raining since midnight so i could not uh, go to my office today then she had been crying so i had to back her that my baby had been crying so what i did i had to really back back her and luckily i discovered that she stopped crying and she slept off so she had been crying so i had to back her we had been arguing we had been arguing arguing okay over who will become the next president okay my friends and her we had been arguing since we met each other we had been arguing over who is going to be okay the next president of the united states the next president okay of nigeria if they say and then the next one is they had been writing on the board since no teacher was in the class that the students what they did was that they started teaching each other they started teaching one another and they went to the board and one of them was really explaining okay the mathematical concepts because there was no teacher around so they, they had to really organize themselves i think they, they realized that the, the teachers were having this uh, very uh, crit crucial meeting so there was no teacher on ground to really attend to them so they organized themselves and they started teaching okay uh, themselves so they had been writing on the board since no teacher was in the class so uh, these are simple okay sentences that reveal how to use the past uh, continuous tense and the past perfect uh, progressive tense i thank you so much for your time uh, please do not forget to subscribe to my uh, channel and if you have any questions okay drop them i will definitely respond to your question uh, one one last thing presently i have this whatsapp a group where i teach people all over the world uh, free it is titled daily english a lesson i if you know you're interested you can please drop okay your number i, I, I will oblige you and add you to the whatsapp group uh, thank you so very much and i will see you in the next video